All right, everyone, welcome back to Resident Evil 4 Remake. I've been busy this weekend, but now we're back, and today we're playing it all day long. Okay, I take that back. For about three hours of gameplay, and we are in the church, and we just saved Ashley, and there's a bunch of assholes down in the church. So what we need to do is kill them. We have to kill the assholes. I'm almost thinking I might want to shoot my one mine down there, or, you know, I think I have, I was going to say I have a grenade. By the way, my nose, I got the pollen. It's making my nose itch today, and I apologize, I already almost sneezed on my pre-stream so if you see me like rubbing my nose and messing that's what it is i got probably allergies today um i'm wondering if i what i should do here to take them out let's take a look here see it sucks because you can't just shoot down there i don't think notice that's why all the bars are here it's like they purposely barred the the, the area so you can't shoot down and kill them from up top i feel like they did this on purpose How many of them do you think are down there? I see at least three. There's probably like five or six, I bet. So if I shoot a mine down there, maybe I'll kill one or two. But I guarantee you they're not gonna let me. Right? They're probably gonna say, oh you shot the you shot the floor or whatever. Is that an item? That might be an item to collect. Hmm. I think I'm gonna shoot a mine down there and see what happens. You ready? The fuck is this? Sigma Gamma Phi? Is this her broken fucking cell phone? The fuck do I do with that? Seriously? I just bought this. Sounds like they had a fun time. Someone blew up. I killed at least one. So it looks like we have a co-op situation here. Shout out to King Gabriel who re-upped his membership. Thank you so much, King Gabriel. What do we do? There's no way out. People were saying that was a razor flip phone. Yeah, they were all the rage in the early two thousands. Everyone had a razor flip phone. By the way, this whole church thing is redesigned. It wasn't like this in the original at all. It was a bunch of... You had to do the puzzle in a different area. And then it was a different way out. Like, this is all differently done. It's kind of neat that they redone all this. You can talk to her? Or, huh. I have five mines to use. That's great. Interesting. I have a lot of hand... Wow, I have a ton of handgun ammo. Hmm. Uh, so thank you, King Gabriel. I appreciate that very much. We are now 433 members. Really awesome. We got a bunch of members this morning. I appreciate your support, everybody. All right. I wonder if there's a way for us to go back to the beginning no areas of the game now and do the co-op stuff that we saw okay, earlier. I've got you. Remember the building in the village that you go to go to and you need a co-op to do it? And then there was the other building where you need to go to the attic. Hey. Trust me. Why wouldn't he catch you? <laughs> He'd be a complete asshole. Well, now we're soaked. Thanks. Okay, so this is where we were earlier and we got the flash grenade. Yep. So here's the thing. Can we go back to the village? We can. We can backtrack a bit, and if we go back to the village, that's the that's the building that they needed to do the co-op to get in. Where was the other building? Was it this one? There was a building that had an attic, and we couldn't get into the attic because she wasn't with me. But now we should be able to, but I'm trying to remember where that building was. Shoot. Hmm. Was it this one? I think it was this building right here. So the question is, do we want to backtrack? Oh, wait. It was this one. 
it was this one right here with the collapsible ladder. So if we go... Yeah, if we go back to the village, we could do this. And then if we head south, we can go to the village chief's house and we can do this. And this is optional stuff, I think. Anyway, um... Jade, welcome back. How you doing, man? Good to, see, good to have you back for a full stream. I know you weren't too interested in my React stuff over the weekend, but it's good to have you back here. <clears throat> Roost, I've secured Baby Eagle. Copy that. Is she okay? Affirmative. Well done, Condor One. I'll dispatch a chopper ASAP. I'm sending you the coordinates for the extraction point. Make your way there. Oh, Condor shit. Look what they did. Baby Eagle. Copy that. Yeah. Hurry. The weather is getting worse. Roost out. Oh, never mind. We can move this. See, there's nothing down there for us to do co-op, right? No, that's the shooting range and all of that. All right, let's go through here. Like I said, it's dangerous. Stay close. Okay. They said everything. Oh, the extraction point is this way anyway. So that's actually the way we're going to be heading. That's cool. Oh, and there's a way shrine to open along the way as well. So we got a lot to do. We'll head back to the village. We'll try to go in there. We'll head south to the village chief's house, do that. And then we'll head north up here. Sounds like a plan. Pickle Man, I will see you later. Thanks for chilling on the podcast today. Good to see you. So here you go. Switch between tight and loose formation with right thumbstick. Actually, we'll stick close behind Leon while in tight formation. This can be effective when running past enemies. And then loose. Switch between tight and loose formation. Actually, we'll hang back behind Leon in loose this can help her avoid enemy attacks. Huh. They're coming. Get behind me. Oh, God. What is wrong with these people? Oh, I'm just going to kill them all. Fuck them. Back up. Wow, I'm, I suck. I haven't played in a few days. Oh my god. Why are there so many? There's so many. How am I supposed to do this? Uh. Give me space. Okay. Oh, bullshit. Jesus Christ. Well, I killed a ton of them. Damn. I wonder if there's more down there, if that was it for this area. Um, problem is I have, like, no ammo now. I need TMP ammo, because that's what's killing the guys with the tentacles. Here, let's, let's reload everything first. Can't reload, right? Nothing to reload? What about the hunter rifle? Okay. So now what ammo can I craft? If anything. Man, I can do everything. Um, Shotgun shells, some machine gun. I think I'm going to do the some machine gun ammo. And... I could do one more submachine gun ammo. It's probably what I want to do. Alright. Okay. So I got handgun and submachine gun ammo to match with. 
cool. Whew. I got a dollar tip here. From Snorlax King. He says, I want to make peace with you and I will not charge back. Okay. Thanks for the dollar tip, Snorlax King. Okay. It's a little weird when you say that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We like, hey, I'm here to support. Instead of, oh, don't worry, I'm not going to charge you back. It's a little different, a little weird. I'm just saying, you know, kind of makes me a little bit suspect. I'm just saying, but okay. Curse Solus has just pressed triangle. Thank you. I had no clue. He's just pressed triangle, and you'll open your inventory right away. Thanks. That is way easier. You're correct. So should I go back in? Because there was items, right? Were there items here? No. What happened? There definitely were items on the floor, and now they're gone. Well, I guess we cleared it then. What is this? Oh, okay, I don't have a key. Yeah, I don't have a key. Should I save? Perhaps we should save before we leave. Let's save the game, and then we'll go back to the village. Okay, kid, just try looking for the costumes. There's no extras. Someone said there would be extras. There's no extras. Nope. Oh, well. Someone said there would be extras in the menu. There's no extras in the menu, so I don't know how to look at the costumes. All right, let's save. Extras are in the main menu. Well, then I'm not looking at them. <laughs> I'm playing the game now. Uh, we'll maybe check them all later. I'm not doing that now. Okay. So, are there more? Or are we good? I think we cleared them. So, I don't think we have to worry about it here. We did it all, right? I hope. Fucking hope, man. Oh, no. There's more. Fucking shit. There's a lot more over here. Who put this barrel out? Uh. All right, Here we go. I am I a soul. Missed. On me. What the fuck? Okay. Back up. Okay. No, you're not going to use bait. Fuck you. I wasted a lot of ammo there. Got to get used to the aiming again because I'm not used to it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ah. Got more submachine gun ammo and a green herb. That's excellent because I didn't have any other healing items. Perfect. I have something I think you like. Welcome. Does he have something Got new? A selection of good um, things on sale. No. He doesn't have anything new. What you see is what I've got. Present That's night. good work if I do say so myself. Sell that. that. Everything else we save for combining later. And again, I need... I seriously need one freaking oh, spinel. And I can't get it. I need one yes, spinel for the laser sight, and I can't get it. I, I guess we're just gonna save. All my wares are in <clears throat> tip-top shape. I assume. Ashley is like a normal person compared to OG Ashley, says Daniel. What do you mean by that? Someone dipped the dollars and this is one minute, man. No, it is not. But thanks for the dollar tip. Did I sell keys? I sold one key that I didn't need anymore. Um, didn't say need a key, but that was the only one to, that I had to sell. <clears throat> yeah. <clears throat> okay, but we really have nothing to do here, right? Well, it? No. What can I do you for? Don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> Another safe spot. Sounds good. Okay, back to the village. 
El Grey Zero says, I think Atomic Hearts is a solid 7 out of 10 game. Or 7 5, 5 out of 10 game. Uh, I need someone to get rid of a wild dog roaming the village. So if I killed a wild dog, because it's not like normal dogs, I'll get 8 spinels. Why does it sound to me like it's a boss dog? Right? Right? Anto Kamara, what are you talking about? What are you talking about? Sorry, we need to keep moving. Got it. Take a break. Coleman did a super chat. Did you look at your costumes? No, because people said you could do it from the in-game menu, and they lied. It, I, I was already in the game. Um, apparently, it's you can't do it from the in-game menu. You have to do it from the main menu, and I never went to the main menu. So... <clears throat> was right about the weather. So this is how we get back because it's blocked the other way, right? Yep. Unless there's another way this way. Let's check. It's an enemy right here. I don't think he's blocking anything, is he? Just a window? But I can go underground, too. I don't know. Hmm. I'm trying to decide what to do. Do I want to go underground? Maybe I try underground rather than fight the guy? easy. <clears throat> Was that a chainsaw guy? is back? They brought the cow back. So I think because the storm is raging, the other enemies don't hear you when you kill one. I think that's what they're trying to get at here. What the fuck? That's bullshit. That's complete bullshit. He staggered, but then he gets a free hit and you can't get out of the way. What's the point of the melee attack if he immediately recovers and can insta-kill you after? What the fuck? Where are we back here? Okay. We're back here, apparently, and now there was ammo that I missed. <clears throat> okay. That made no sense. What's the point of stunning the enemy and hitting him with a melee attack if immediately he hits you with a hammer you can't dodge and you die instantly? That's the dumbest thing ever. How fucking stupid. Right? Hunnigan was right about the weather. That was incredibly dumb. Now, remember, I have uh, mines. What I'll do then with that guy, if I shoot him in the head, 
I'll probably shoot him. I'll shoot some mines in front of him and see if he'll walk into the mines and die. That way I don't have to deal with him. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> All right. I can't fucking aim. Dude, it's so stupid. Come on, let me aim. She's right in front of me. No, you can't hit her. Shut the fuck up. Dumb. <clears throat> this is pretty fucking dumb. So fuck this. I'm just gonna use mines everywhere. I like I, sh I shoot the fucking cow guy two to three times in the head with our, our fucking rifle ammo. He just ignores it like I didn't do anything. But how much fucking health does he have on hardcore? <laughs> It would be nice if you could snipe them from over here, but I guarantee you they're not going to let you. See? So maybe you can. Maybe you could actually get them from this angle, and that's cheaper that they can't get you. I could try it. What the fuck? Bullshit. I did not shoot the fucking thing in front of me. You're so full of shit. Dude, that's bullshit. So now the bullets hit stuff in front of you when you have a line of sight to the enemy? Fuck you. No, that's complete fucking bullshit. And the game fucking knows it too. That's just complete nonsense. That is such bullshit. Look, how are you gonna tell me I can't shoot through here? You got your fucking mind? Of course I can. They're just full of shit lies. Fuck that. That legit pisses me off. That's artificial difficulty. You're trying to play it smart, and the game cheats and makes your bullets hit the wall. She on me. Why did the fucking thing not go off? Back up. Okay. No problem. He's not fucking dead. This is insane. At least I killed the bull dude now. No melee. Not available. Even though I'm right there. Oh, now I can't hit her. I can't hit her. Look at this fucking nonsense. Shut the fuck up. Sh fucking shoot! Jesus, fuck. 
fucking dumb, man. Thanks. Anytime. She's right in front of me. I'm shooting her. The bullets are going through the body and not registering. Yeah, you see, that's just this part that pisses me off. That whole part was made to be artificially difficult. It didn't have to be that hard. But the game basically created a situation where you can't fucking do normal stuff. Oh, you can't just shoot over here. Why? It's wide open. Oh, you're hitting an invisible wall. Sure I am. No, that's bullshit. I'm trying to play it smart. Like any normal person would probably fucking try to do in this survival situation. And the game fucks you over and says, oh, you can't play it smart. Then all of a sudden, my bullets won't hit from point blank. Right. That's artificial difficulty, and that shit pisses me off. That's the first time really in the game I feel like it's been unfair right there. That's stupid. Very stupid. Okay. Anyway. Let's continue. So I got a dollar tip. I was trolling heavily. We know One Minute Man is you. No, it is not. One Minute Man is not me. And then I received a tip. I believe this is from One Minute Man. It is. A $20 tip from One Minute Man. So thank you to One Minute Man for that. That's our usual uh, $20 contribution for the stream. I really appreciate that, One Minute Man. Thank you very much. Get that up on the leaderboard. And so we're up to $35 in tips so far today, everybody. Thank you so much. Uh, and we are almost to our first goal of 50 bucks to be gunner glasses. Thank you, thank you. Okay. So now hopefully the rest of the fucking village will be fair and not be full of shit. That would be nice. I guess we're about to find out. I don't know how well we just cleared the village by killing all those things. They did say there's a dog in the village, correct? I hear more. We should try to get into the building we couldn't get into before over here. I feel like this is going to be a good item or something, which is why you had to wait till this part of the game to do it. Here we go. Over here. Okay. I need you to open it from the other side. still can't open that door. Alright, let's see what we got here. Hopefully some good shit. An extra kitchen knife. Ooh, what do we got here? An elegant bangle. Okay. This has two slots, so I could put two valuable uh, gems into it to sell. Okay. Is that all that's in here? Just some, uh, just some crafting items, it looks like. I guess that's it. Yep, that's it. That's nah, still not bad. We'll sell it for something in there. For something in there. For something uh, out there. Like a vendor. So, I know there's a barrel I saw. That was new. That wasn't there previously over here. Right there. Oh, here's an item. I don't even know how the, why this item is sitting here. This was been from earlier and I just left it there. So now hold on a second. I actually want to go this way. Yup. Because I want to go back to this and loot this house. But I don't know what kind of enemies are going to be between me and there. I guess we're about to find out. Here we go. Keep your diamonds yellow for valuable items to maximize your profits later. Okay. But then again, I might be able to get more too, you know? So I don't know. It's kind of a hard... Hard to decide when to use what. It would be nice if there were no new enemies, but... I feel like that's wishful thinking. That there's definitely going to be new enemies here. Maybe not. I just want to go home. 
Shut up, we're looting. No time to go home. When you're in jewelry mode, hit square. Does nothing. Uh, it'll show the ideal color combo for gems. No, this just shows the key. Right. So it shows, you know, what you can do. All it is is two colors or duo. That's it. Yeah. I get that. We saw that before. Here it is. So this is the house. There's a save point in there. I thought there was... Oh, shit. This is the Savage Mutt. This is the side quest. It's in here. There is a, uh, a save point. A Savage Mutt. fuck is it? I guess we gotta go in. It says it's here, but I don't see it. Where are the stairs? Oh, what's this? Oh, shit! Did I miss that earlier in the game? I wonder. Ugh. What the hell is that? I don't even know what that is. They were skinning some animal. An egg. There's an egg in the oven. I'll eat it. Hell yeah. Eat that freaking egg, that baby. That my last one. Maybe the, maybe the dog's out back. Here's our save point, so we should definitely save because we don't know what we're going to find. Okay. So once again, this is uh, a situation where this is different from the original game. In the original game, there was no attic to go to, and, and just like there was no building to go to in the village like that with Ashley. So this was this is different from the original. Okay. Come on. Do a boost. Okay. See so what we got up here. Hopefully some good items. Why, thank you, Ashley. What is this place? Oh, look, an owl. Hello. Stuffed owl. A yellow herb. That's great, so I have nothing to combine it with. A book. Village Records Volume 2. All the men cheered when they heard the boat as it raced across the surface of the water. The magnificent oil will surely help us catch fish easier than ever before. The ironworks was only built a year ago, but has already merged well with the village. Our sickles and knives shine like never before. The two fish we got from the deal will eat almost anything and are breeding well. The fish farm in the swamp is also making excellent progress. During the day, I teach literacy and mathematics to the children. Every evening, I dine with a single family to hear their grievances and recent gossip all under the roof of this home that we built. Since I opened the village up to the outside, we have prospered and the people are happier. Smiles have even started to appear on their faces. A strange group of black robe people descended upon the village from the castle and raised an ominous flag with a spider-like insignia on it. After preaching about salvation and forgiveness, they injected us with something they claim will cure us of madness. Can they be trusted? So there you go. That is how they, uh, they infected them all with the Lost Plagos and turned them into their servants. What's going on, Mr. Humble? How are you? Father's portrait. Watch over the village in my stead, and may smiles always find you in the photographs. Huh. So this is a dark room. Resources large. Photo of the factory. Long awaited ironworks, 1992. A hand grenade. Village Records Volume 1. The elder entrusted the village to me today. He told me I can learn my duties as I go. Keep records of the village. The grandfather doesn't talk much. I'm boy in the cabin. The next day he was gone. It was a terrible night. Blah, 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 blah. An antique camera. What the fuck do I do with that? 
Total of a boy and his grandfather, the Navarro family. So what do I do with the antique camera? For selling only 10,000 pesetas. Okay, it's a sellable item. Let's make sure I didn't miss anything. Let's canvas the, the area. Alright, there's the... Uh... What's making that noise? You hear that, right? It sounds like it's over here. Oh shit, look, look, look! Oh man! So whenever we hear an ongoing noise like that, there's gonna be one of the hidden figurines. Okay, we've only found two. How many did I miss? Like seven? <laughs> we've only found two so far? Alright. Casanova says Sony should have made a, a chainsaw PS5 controller. Yes, if you remember on GameCube back in the day, you could buy a chainsaw shaped controller to play this game. Which is pretty funny because you never really use a chainsaw in it. But the enemies do. Um, Alright, let's see. What ammo would be the most useful to me right now? Honestly, probably more submachine gun ammo, I would think. Between rifle and flash gun, yeah, I'm gonna do more submachine gun ammo. I got a bonus. I don't know why I got a bonus, but I got a bonus. Now all I can do is handgun. I'll hold off then. Okay. There's one for PS2 as well. That's right, because it did come out on PS2 as well as GameCube. That's right. I forgot about that. So now we gotta find this dog. Right, let's save again and see if we can find the dog outside for the optional quest. It's probably going to be one of the mutant dogs with tentacles, I bet. And you, get eight, you get eight spinels for killing the damn thing, so it must be a tough fight. It's probably out back, you think? What the hell is this? Oh, it's the bathroom where that guy was earlier, remember? Killed him. Right, let's see here. Get ready. Fucks the dog. They fight up. I don't see him. Huh. You used to be able to go this way, but it's blocked now. It's claiming the dogs in this area, but it's really not. Like, I went through the whole area, there's no dog. Right? Kind of confused right now. We've gone through the whole house. TMP is fully loaded for this fucker. So we have to chase him back to the village? Oh. Give me space! 
What the fuck? How many hits? Jesus fucking Christ. I want to do all of my ammo. That thing took all my ammo and I have no healing either. All that for a shitty Alexandrite. Now I know that I'm going to get, you know, eight spinels for it, but holy fucking shit, dude. So the only thing I can think of now, I mean, I'm fucked, right? Is to go all the way back to the vendor. The merchant and probably buy a first aid spray, right? Like, what else am I gonna do? I'm f I have no healing at all. Like, that was insanity. Our hardcore mode, this shit is ridiculous, man. Oh my god. Did ya? <laughs> well, look at you. Thanks. Eight spin L's what for that fucker. So the first thing I'm gonna do is get the goddamn laser sight. Give it to me now, you fucking asshole. <laughs> a wise choice. Everything else is like high-powered scope. I don't really need that right now. I don't really need the diamonds. I'll save for hopefully a better trade later. Right now, I can sell the antique camera for sure. Thank you. I, I think I need to buy a first aid spray. I have zero healing, so I'm just gonna buy one. Better to be over. Come back. There. I have no ammo for anything. <laughs> Nothing. I guess I should I should just make handgun ammo. I need it. I have nothing else, right? Anytime. That's it. I can't make anything else. Yeah, no bolts. Nope. I can do nothing. Wow, I'm so low on resources. It's ridiculous. Alright, well. Can I attach the laser sight? Alright, this should make me way more accurate, right, with my shots. I hope so, considering how much it costs. Hopefully this makes you wait. By the way, it's completely unrealistic. Look at it. Look how it moves with the gun. That's not how it works. A laser is always straight. I'm moving and the laser is, sw is swaying left and right. That's not how it works. <laughs> Look at that. How could the laser be behind the gun? It's not even possible. Look, the laser is behind the gun. I don't know how lasers work. I guess whoever made the game doesn't know how a laser works. Anyway. Uh. I got a dollar tip from Gamer Guy saying there will be one hidden figurine per chapter. Upon destroying them all, you get the primal knife, which can be upgraded to infinite durability. Oh. Well, I'm in chapter five, and I found one. So I guess we're done. I guess I'm not getting them all. <laughs> there you go. They must have been somewhere, and I didn't know that they were there, and I missed them all. So. Shucks. Okay. Anyway, let's save. I have my laser sight now. I don't know how it's going to really help me. Ammo is kind of more important, but... Let's continue. Alright. Now we can get back through the village to the, uh... The evacuation point, which obviously we're not going to make it to. We know we're not getting out of here. Do a new game plus... Oh, wait! Oh, I didn't... See... Oh, I didn't even look at this. There was a troll... People were saying there was a troll super chat earlier. I missed it. I didn't even see it. Should I ban them? Alright. Here you go. Enjoy. I didn't even see it. <laughs> okay. Thanks for telling me. 
Before leaving the village, you can backtrack to get some. To get some what? Huh? What are you talking about? There's nothing over there. I don't know what people are... I really have no clue what's going on. Anyway, let's continue. Oh, you know what? There's a guy on the underground tunnel that we could just stealth kill and get a bonus, right? Yeah, look. There's no reason to not stealth kill this guy and get a bonus. Some gunpowder, see? Well, that worked out. That definitely will help. Okay. By the way... I was gonna say, can you combine gunpowder? Because I had two separate gunpowders, but they did combine. Okay. Good. There we go. Because Casanova said, yes, he did the lean and manual ban emote. It was a hint. I didn't see it. I was pretty busy with the, the craziness of the game. Is there anything in here? No. What's this cow? Alright, so now we have to head further this way, and there were enemies this way. I did see at least one or two more enemies this way. We have to look for new barrels or something, too, as we walk through. Should I should I go back into the house just in case? Did they add anything new in here? I mean, I doubt it. There will be something over here, I think, right? The way shrine we can do on the way. But I doubt that they add any new items or anything in the house. I'll double check. Spread out. Okay. With me. No problem. This is gonna be a problem because I accidentally am clicking the thumbstick. Spread out. Okay. Stick close. Uh, I accidentally okay. even click it when I'm trying to aim. I bet, and then she's gonna fucking run off and get killed. Not good. How does he get up here? Does he get up here? That's the way further. Where'd the guy go? Head popper. What happened? I can't see. What happened? It's pitch black. The fuck? Did you see that? It went pitch black. I couldn't see anything. The lighting glitched. Dude, I have like no ammo. See? No problem. I keep accidentally telling her to do shit. We have no ammo again. I have to make more handgun ammo. I have none. I have to do it. Jesus. Alright, let's go down. I mean, I've now cleared the whole goddamn town of enemies. Right? I've killed everything. What sucks is they restocked the, the town with with uh, enemies, but they didn't restock it with ammo. So you have to do double fucking ammo on this shit. Ruffian forever. I don't know if what you're saying is true or not. Nor do I care. Thanks. <laughs> it's like hardcore is the default difficulty, bro. No, it's actually not. If you read the menu, what it said is if you've never played Resident Evil Four before, play it on standard. If you've played it on, on, on standard, it makes no sense to play this on standard because you've already played that, so play it on hardcore. Like, why are you arguing about what the default difficulty is? Who cares? Okay. So I have... Let's just recap. I have no healing... 
<clears throat> I have almost no ammo. And there's really nothing I can do about it, right? Seriously, this can't be happening. It looks like it's happening. Could make some extra submachine gun ammo. I, I guess I will. Yeesh. Dude, this is ridiculous. Another one? Every one of them is a Transformer. They all fucking mutate now. Shit, you fuck face. I shot you. This is ridiculous. There's so many. A cowhead. How the fuck am I going to stop the cowhead guy? God! All right. Jesus Christ! I have no ammo for any gun, right? I have no healing. I have two fucking rifle rounds and one crossbow bolt. <laughs> That's what they gave me to work with. I can't craft any ammo. Oh my god, dude. I have one flash grenade and one regular grenade. That's it. If there's no ammo in this area, I don't know what I'm supposed to do to continue. This is crazy. Insane amount of enemies and no ammo anywhere. <clears throat> I guess we have to hope that I just cleared it. Nope, there's another one. I mean, there's there's the vendor past him. There's another guy right there. Oh my god. No, you can't do a knife only run because your knife breaks. I guess I could just try to knife them, but I don't know how that's going to work. This is insanity, man. This is pretty insanity, dude. It's insane. 
<laughs> yeah, I've crafted my ammo. I've crafted all the ammo you can craft. The game doesn't give me any resources. Welcome. It won't even let me buy healing items. I have money, and they won't let me buy any healing items. Might want to take care of any leftover errands before going this way. Unbelievable. There's a way shrine over there I need to open. Maybe there's an item there? I don't know. I guess I should save with my, my five bullets and no health. This is pretty insane. I don't know what they were thinking. Like, I'm, I'm playing as well as I can. And uh, the game is pretty much just destroying me with insane amounts of enemies and no ammo anywhere. It's like, just drop some ammo, dude. Another antique pipe to sell, but the money is useless because you can't buy ammo at the shop. <laughs> they give you money you can't use for anything. Look, can't buy nothing. All you can do is tune up. And you don't know. Look, everything's empty. How useful. You get some Thanks. You. Don't get yourself killed now. <laughs> Alright. Well, let's save. I don't know, man. Alright. Well, I'm going to continue. I'm getting my ass handed to me. Alright.